Hey Scorpios, and welcome back for a bonus reading, honey. Let's get them in. So let's tap into your person energy and see, I guess this is a separation reading for those of you who are in separation. Does your person miss you? Will your person reach out to you? Will your person, per person, will your person make amends or is it time to walk away, okay? Ultimately, it is your choice, but for those who care and who are still hoping for a reconciliation, hopefully this video will bring you some type of truth or clarity for your next steps for your highest good. So let's see for Scorpios. What's going on with this person spirit? The person here who has feelings for Scorpios, whether they are showing them, whether it's been revealed or not, what are their intentions, what are their head space, what is their heart space? How do they feel? What are they thinking? Will they make any moves? Have they moved on? And why are they not coming in? So let's see. But I feel like, well, I'm gonna let the cards say, because it may be a different set of Scorpio's energy that I'm picking up. So let me just let the cards say. All right, Spirit, show me the person that's in love with Scorpio's that are separated. Love and separation, Scorpios, love and separation. I'm in love under new management. Nine of Pentacles in the reverse though. Mm. Could be somebody here who is very, very selfish and self-centered. Or it could be somebody here who's very, very alone and isolated. They go to high priestess here, followed by the chariot in the reverse. It could be a cancer. They're not able to let go. They're not able to move on. The very thing that maybe they wanted, like their space, they're getting it. See, somebody is, somebody is feeling like they done messed up. If somebody told you they needed space, they regretting it now because y'all probably took way much more space than they thought. Could have been somebody here who was wanted to only do their own thing and come in when they wanted to, and now you done gave them all the space in the world, but now you ain't there. Ace of Cups. Now I wonder did this person go start over new somewhere else or they're thinking about you? Could be a Pisces. The moon. I feel like it's that thing. If you think you're lonely now, huh, wait until tonight. Scorpio's person, king of wands, the tower, see? Seven of swords, <laughs> five of swords, nine of wands page of cups. I feel like they want to come back and make it right because they didn't mean, they said this thing got out, they said this got out of hand. When stunting goes horribly, horribly wrong, when flexing your independence goes horribly, horribly wrong. Because see, Scorpios can't hang with you if you acting like you're independent from Scorpios. Scorpios deal with unions. <laughs> Oh, I feel like this is somebody plans that went horribly, horribly wrong. They got exactly what they wanted and they don't like it. Once again, it's a hard pill for somebody to swallow. See? Look at them. They, they ain't sleeping good. They looking crazy. This is a wake up call or a realization to your person that they did what it took to not be with you. So what do they expect? I'm just saying, what you expect? We're talking about Scorpio here. So you got the Nine of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. You got the Chariot, the Ace of Cups, look, the Tower, <laughs> the High Priestess, Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. You got the Nine of Wands, the King of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries. You have the Seven of Swords and the Five of Swords, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. You got their page of cups underneath the bottom with the Fool. I bet they do. King of Cups. Mm. 
I feel like somebody here is their ego is get is being taken down. And then it could also represent this person wants back in Scorpios. Why is the nine of pentacles in the reverse? For the person in love with Scorpios, what's going on with this person? How do they feel? What are they thinking? Are they missing Scorpios? What are they going through? They go to Ace of Wands. King of Pentacles. See, somebody regressed this. Somebody was too cocky. Ace of Wands. King of Pentacles. All about them. And the Five of Cups. Once again, I feel like this is when flexing goes wrong because they were not listening to their intuition. They were proud, they were smug, and they were arrogant. So it was like, laugh now, cry later is what I get. They could have been laughing and smug then, but they crying now. Scorpio, that's what's going on with your person because they can't let it go because they know that they lost you. Seven of Swords, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. What's up with the Seven of Swords? Running away from this connection, avoiding. I mean, if you run away from somebody and you avoid them, what you think? You think they're going to want you? I wouldn't. All you got to do is avoid me and <laughs> play games with me, and I know you're doing it. I'm gone. I ain't going to even... See, I see most Scorpios not going to be feeling you like that no more because you'll lose interest on in a person that do things like this, like whatever your person did, this, you're gonna lose interest in this because it's open disrespect, it's open manipulation. Seven of Swords. See, that's what they asses get, see? Ooh, spirit talking, see? See how they did you with that Seven of Swords? See? See how they see how they didn't want this? It was one side. They came in, took what they wanted, and they ran off. They got what they wanted. Seven of Wands, see? Somebody was very, very haughty and very, very arrogant. And that's why they regretting it now. Cause I feel like you ain't nowhere to be found now. Seven of Swords. See how they play with your feelings, Scorpios, and I hope this don't trigger you because you deserve better than this anyway. I'm just saying. Seven of Swords. See? They rejected that. See? Wow. See there? This is what y'all could have had. This is what they were supposed to have did. And now it could represent somebody feels like you don't want them now. They may be trying to come back in with an offer. Five of Swords in reverse, see, it's over. When you broke up with them, now they in their head. See there, that's all they thinking about, the Four of Swords. Now they thinking. Now they thinking, but sometimes you can't undo the mistrust. Sometimes it takes forever to build somebody trust, and then sometimes somebody don't want to give you their energy again. Five of Swords in the reverse. Somebody feels defeated now because it has backfired on them. Playing them games, see? Now they stuck from their own doing once again. See there? Somebody can't get over you. Playing all those games. You got the lovers and the nine of pentacles. Somebody feels guilty. Scorpio is what I'm feeling like. Oh, there go justice. It could be a Libra, see? Five of pentacles, see? See, and once again, they're not able to move on either. They stuck and they full of confusion now. See? Games and came back on them now. Five of Swords. That Nine of Pentacles <laughs> want to come out. 
See, like I said, it was all about their independence. Now, they could be looking at you like you're single. I know they got the Nine of Pentacles up there in the reverse. They go to Star Card. Now, what's up with this um, High Priest? Now, why is the Tower here? Clarify the Tower. Four Swords. Something coming that they did not see coming. Something may have happened in their life that they did not see coming. Like they may have not expected for you to pull all the way back from them. See? It's them backfired on them, Scorpio. See? Like I said, they wasn't expecting for you to pull all the way back. I feel like somebody was playing hard to get and it backfired. Because by them playing hard to get made you feel like they wasn't interested. And maybe they wasn't. They was playing games, Scorpio, and this them backfire, see? And now there's delays, there are blockages, ain't nothing happening, you ain't doing nothing, see? Six of Cups. They're in their head trying to figure out what happened. It's them backfired on them. Because of that Five of Swords, now they feeling defeated because they wasn't, they're surprised. Somebody didn't see this coming. They've been manipulating or they just thought that they were slick and getting away with it. But like I said, their uh, pride and arrogance set them up to fail. Because you must be gone. Now they missing that Queen of Cups. See how they was doing you? Seven of Swords, Six of Pentacles in the reverse. They're supposed to offer you more. I feel like they want to now. But they, but but now they're overthinking things. It's just so sad. Nine of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries. Why is the Nine of Wands here? Blocking in their head. They got mental. They got blockages person has, see? I feel like this person's been trying to block you for so long, Scorpios, and move on, but they always coming back around. They, they in, there's somebody's whew, emotionally blocked and emotionally mentally damaged, but I know they can't get over you. Did I see the Emperor? No, that's in another reading. Libra could be a Libra. They go to Three of Swords. I feel like somebody ain't healed. Somebody may be afraid that you could break their heart. That's what it is, Scorpio, see? So someone been doing all this manipulation and all these games because they feel like if they was to let you, if they was to open up to you, like they hard probably telling them, then all you're gonna do is break them. Look, this is what they think. You could break their heart, Scorpios. This is why they've been blocking it. And yes, it ain't fair, but that's why they doing it. Don't mean because they ain't in love. It's just that somebody feels like you could have so much control over them that you could be the one that could break their heart. So they pl play games and manipulate the relationship. They manipulated you right on out their life. They created things that maybe wasn't even real. See? They say it was just too intense. Once again, they stand in their ground. Seven days, somebody blocked the shit out of this. But it's because they had inner conflict or maybe it's because it was other people involved. Other people telling your person what they should and shouldn't do. Your person may have been getting advice from other insecure people. Could all them ones. Could be a fire sign. Somebody say you just break their heart. Somebody say you the heartbreaker. Somebody say if they was to let their guards down for one second, it would be over for them. Why is the high priestess? Why is the high priestess here? Pisces. Mm. Just seeing the devil. Clarify the high priestess. Could be a Pisces. The star. I feel like this is somebody here that's 
keeps a lot of things to themselves. Okay? If this person was insecure, they're not going to tell you that. They're just going to play games. I feel like somebody thought so highly of you, but in their weak thinking, they thought that the abundance that you bring could bring them down. I guess somebody say you're just too good to be true. Wow. See, eight of swords, but they in their head again. Feeling stuck, now that's the nine of swords. See, they overthink things because they know you're their wish fulfilled. They know that. But once again, somebody is very, very insecure. Oh my God, Scorpio, this is clear as day. They're scared that you could hurt them. Somebody said if they was to give in with you, you would be the one that would hurt them because they feel like they could really fall in love with you. See, it's all bad energy. Could be a Capricorn. Ooh, the chariot in the reverse. So when this person comes around you, for some of you guys, it could be a fire sign with this king of one, but I feel like they fronting like they the man and they really don't feel like that. See, they trying to move on so bad, but they can't. See? This chariot in the reverse, they're not able to overcome this. They're not able to move on away from this. They want to, but they stuck, see? See, they're still attached to your energy, see? <laughs> and that's why, God dang it, see? <laughs> you don't walk away and they still looking in your direction in they feeling, see? See, somebody feels like, feel like somebody wants to open up but they are afraid to, they are so afraid. Somebody's afraid to open up and tell you how they really feel. Cause somebody feels like, <laughs> like once again, I think I'm gonna go watch that picture. Give me a glass of wine and watch it. It's a thin line between love and hate. He said, did you tell her that you loved her? Man, I guarantee you, you ain't got that. You listen, a woman like that, you got to tell her that you, but she, you know, she had a problem anyway. Shout out to Lynn Whitfield. She's such an amazing, beautiful actress. He said, I love you. <laughs> it was it. He created a monster. <laughs> he couldn't get rid of her. But he was playing games with her. That was such a dangerous thing to do. And he found that out too. That grew him up because his mom was like, Marcus, what was her name? Reese, Re Re Della Reese. Marcus, what's his name, Marcus? She said, no, she's, what she said, uh, uh, it's a thin line between love and hate. She said something like that. And he just thought he was the it guy. It was so funny. That's a funny, that's a funny movie. Cause that's just how, that's how it be when they have them clubs. They, they get the feel, they sit, they get the young guys, to, you know, to, to, to hype the crowd, to bring the people in and everybody wanted to be on the crowd. And at first, he, but I'm saying he was a real player though, cause look how he changed. Cause at first she didn't want to get him the time of day cause he really wasn't on her level if you would have want to keep it real. So I guess in a sense, that's what happens when you settle and you date down. Cause she knew better than been dating him. But he, he got her attention. He did things that, you know, like for instance, she was a real estate agent. He, you know, he went and had her show him a house. No, he couldn't afford that mansion, but at least he got her attention. It's those little things, but he was playing the whole freaking time. And that five or so, he was playing games the whole time. So for your person, it's like they do not want to face, it's like somebody will not admit this, but I feel like it's being exposed anyway. You got the Ace of Swords, the Moon, and the High Priest. It's like somebody said, they'll never tell you. Or somebody probably said, man, you never tell the woman you love her, man. They, they, man, you trying to mess up everything. Man, once you tell a woman you love them, they're going to take advantage of you. They're going to do this, and they're going to do that. That's what somebody's telling your person with that Five of Wands and that Seven of Wands. And they've been determined to stand their ground ever since, and that's how come you ain't around. Now you got the king of wands. Like I say, this is somebody here who tries to act like they got it together, but they don't. <laughs> I 
this person is one one heartbreak away away from ending up in some type of hospital okay <laughs> they overthink i'm telling you i guess this person feels like they deal with a lot of self-sabotaging energies that they don't need to deal with trying to figure out if you really love them or not scorpios because i feel like you could break them and i feel like somebody's afraid to let you know how much power you really do have over them See, king of wands, three of cups, see? This is someone here who tries to act like they're the life of the party. And then it could also represent this person wants to come back and try. This person could be out here acting like they okay. This person could be out here dating or trying to date other people or just, I saw that another time. I feel like somebody's steady trying to get your person out here with the king of wands, because they really the king of cups in love with you. See, eight of wands, I feel like somebody's trying to see. Somebody's trying to forget about you, Scorpios, but I feel like it's hard. Eight of Wands, the Hierophant in the reverse. So I feel like your person has been out here conversation. It could be dating other people. It ain't nothing. It's not serious, but it's just the point that they are out here doing it. Because you got that Nine of Pentacles and the Seven of Cups. See, once again, they're trying to act like they're okay. They're trying to like they're the man. But this is how they is about you. See, they're not able to let go, but they, somebody need their mind to stay off of you is what I feel like. See, I told you this person's dating other people, trying to act like they're not bothered. They go to lover's card. Could be with an air sign, see? Wow. And then it could also represent that somebody is trying to walk away. Well, let's see. King of Wands, wow, so we could be dealing with the fire sign, or air sign, water sign, earth sign. See, and that go to death card, see? I feel like for some of you guys, as soon as your person started dating third parties, it ended, okay? Because once again, you ain't gonna be able to replace that empress, especially when you are already in love with that queen of cups. See, as soon as it started, it ended. See, they go to world cards, see? I feel like your person did try to date other people, but it didn't work because they won't back in with this Ace of Cups with you. Ace of Cups for the person in love with Scorpios. Mm. King of Swords. It's like they're trying to stay away from you because you're kind of like their kryptonite. I feel like Scorpio's love is like your soulmate's kryptonite. See, like I said, this person is scared of you. The moon. I feel like they hide their feelings, but once again, they're getting a wake-up call or a realization. I feel like it's about you. Somebody may be realizing that they can't move on away from you. They're in love. Mm. So somebody may be stop dating other people and try to come back to you, see? But once again, they go to high priestess. I feel like they're gonna try to keep it to themselves though. I feel like somebody do not want you to know that they are in love because they feel like you a dog and you will hurt them. See? Eight of Pentacles in the reverse. Somebody could be looking at you like you're no longer interested in them, especially with the Queen of Swords, the High Priest. They could be saying that now you may not be interested in them. Like I said, there's a lot of regret that this person is dealing with. Because like I said, they're in love, but they can't let you go. But it's almost like... I feel like you're their kryptonite and it ain't got nothing to do with you. It has to do with their own internal issues that they need to address because they manipulated this connection. It's all because they did not want you to have control over them because from what they say, you never tell somebody that you're in love with them and you never settle down. Wow. All right, Scorpio, that's your person. The person that's in love with you. If it resonates, please like, share, and subscribe.